when you're in an improv theater, um, the people that you in your head think aren't good enough or not as good as I am, or I don't want to play with, in a weird way, they kind of get discriminated against. Yes, they do. And That's... it was something when we were talking that I, I, I mean, I'm going to own it. I was guilty of that when I started out. If you weren't good, I didn't, you know, I want to just hang out with my friends were the good people, even though I wasn't good. I wanted to hang out with the good people. And I thought, wow, this is really interesting because I, that's something that's never been talked about in improv. And you were like, you, you, oh, yeah. you get it. So how do you deal with that? Because I, that's, that's a serious uh, topic that never gets discussed. Yeah. So that's what um, I, when I was sharing with you, that's who I've been in every improv scene that I've been a part of, right? I've walked into regular rooms and Zoom rooms where people are looking at me like, are you here because you're good or are you here because you're black? Or are you here because you're black and you're a woman? Or, you know, are you good? But rarely, rarely is it like that actual feeling of, are you good? Like you're here because of, you know, people are trying to fill a quota here mm -hmm. or, or because George Floyd was murdered and now we have to put out this statement and pretend as if we're inclusive now. Um, so it's a terrible feeling, even if you take color and, and gender out of it. Um, and I've always been the person to be like, get in here. We're going to play. You know, I don't care what level you're at. I'm going to make you look really good. We're going to have so much fun. You're going to have you're going to feel comfortable on stage. We're going to hang out after you can call me. You can text me. You can email me. Uh, you can talk to me. You're a part of this community as much as that person who gets so much stage time that totally doesn't deserve so much stage time, but they stay after at the bar and they talk to everybody. And so they think that they're cool. Like you're cool too. Jimmy, Jimmy Corrine, Jimmy Corrine's a nerd. Jimmy Corrine's an improv nerd. Jimmy Corrine's a nerd. Oh, Jimmy. Jimmy Corain, Jimmy Corain's a man.